That was a message delivered to State Councillor Wang Yi by EU foreign ministers on Monday. It marked a shift toward what EU diplomats say is a more assertive and competitive mindset. In the past, it has been extremely difficult for the EU to formulate a clear strategy on China, and past policy documents have not been strategically coherent, said Duncan Freeman at the EU-China Research Center at the College of Europe. There is now a clear effort to do that. In a document to prepare the EU summit, the European Commission called China a systemic rival. U.S. President Donald Trump's campaign to warn against Huawei telecommunications equipment in next-generation wireless networks has accelerated EU discussions about its position. The deepest tensions lie around China's slowness to open up its economy, a surge of Chinese takeovers in critical sectors, and an impression that Beijing has not stood up for free trade. Germany is key with over a billion euros a day in bilateral trade, the EU is China's top trading partner, while China is second only to the United States as a market for European goods and services. Chinese trade restrictions are more severe than EU barriers in almost every economic sector, according to research firm Rhodium Group and the Mercator Institute for China Studies. Germany's views will be important as Berlin has at times pressed for a tougher response to unfair competition from Chinese rivals but also championed a closer relationship with Beijing. Their position needs to stabilize. At the moment it changes on almost every day of the week, the senior envoy said.